What's up my dudes, we're back here in Atlas checking out another admin command. So uh, this is not a how to spawn. So I just went into my single player. I don't actually have a character made in single player and I didn't wanna like even mess with it. I didn't save my preset. Uh, well, I did an official and for some reason it didn't save the character preset for single player. I didn't feel like remaking my character or putting a kit on. So that's why I'm standing here naked. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys today how to uh, automatically unlock all of the discovery zones and uh, so for those of you who are not familiar with Atlas, you probably won't even be searching this video. If you clicked on it without knowing what discovery zones are, uh, you have to acquire these discovery zones. Basically, you have to discover the map uh, or explore the map to raise your max level. Uh, so this is a cheat on how to unlock every discovery zone without doing that. Uh, it'll get you max level 150 automatically. Uh, you'll have some of the quests done. You'll be able to get the shark, uh, the new shark uh, steering wheel skin. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to show you guys that. And then I want to give you guys some insight on unlocking discovery zones in official. Because as we all know, the official map is absolutely huge. And uh, they've been making some changes lately that kind of change the way we go about spreading beds. You actually have to take, you know, a small structure or whatever. Anyway, we'll get on that in a minute. I want to show you guys right off the bat. Uh, what the code is for the uh, discovery zone. So it's going to be cheat space give all disco zones. Give all disco zones. Right. Yeah, I think the actually didn't say we unlocked all the quests, but now we can see right here our max level is 150, where it was 51 before. We only had two points. Right now there's 5,800. And 52 points and if, if we click on discoveries we can actually see every single discovery for every single grid is uh, completely unlocked we're not gonna go through all those I think there's 200 and something grids but uh, so anyway back to official now on official we used to take what thatch or wood floors with one bed uh, sail to an island place the bed sail to another island place the bed uh, and then we would have teammates spawn in on the bed, run around trying to get more discovery points. And uh, well, they re they've recently changed something uh, that kind of auto decays your structures if it's not more than like, I think two foundations or something. So yeah, you have to be more legit about doing this. You can't just go around like spreading beds like we all used to. Um, you're actually probably the best bet to do it legit for your whole company if you're not like a solo player uh, would be to just go ahead and go all out and take start toting stone structures around uh, enough to put up like even if it's like a one by one hut with a bed in it that'll protect the bed it'll protect it from auto decaying and uh i don't know it'll make the most out of your time because who wants to go around jumping off and not setting beds to help your teammates out right so anyway yeah that's official uh, that's a whole nother story i've spent 1700 hours in official so hopefully my insight can help you guys. I was in a, uh, in a PVP, still am. Anyway, so I wanna talk about how to see your discovery zones if you're in the server and you're not quite sure where they are because a lot of these islands have more than one. Some of them have up to like five or six, uh, just depending. Some servers have, up. I think the max discovery zones in one server, I think it was like B1 had quite a bit uh, or B, yeah, I think it was B1 or something like that. It had like 22-ish. So um, yeah, sometimes, there's more per island and you can't exactly find where they're at um, by just running around. A lot of times they're like up on the cliffs. But anyway, if you take a spyglass and you spyglass an island, you can actually see, let's see if we can see it pop up. Oh, I did discovery zone. So I, since I did the cheat now, I have these. If I wouldn't have done that, I would have been able to spyglass these islands and you'll actually see a blue uh, dome come up around the island so if you're on a big island with more than one discovery area or uh, zone just make sure you're running around with a spyglass if you happen to have it if you're really trying to hunt these things down you know you're gonna need a spyglass and uh, just spyglass like the high top some of them are around statues or structures or uh, a lot of them are high up you know on some of these spires Especially on the east side of the map, you've got uh, a lot of the east side of the map has spires on their islands, like mountains, basically, uh, that you're going to have to climb up and glide around and watch your stamina and all that. So the east side, I would definitely work your way from like the left to the right 
That way you're higher level, you have more stamina and health to deal with the east side of the map. I really do like the east side of the map compared to the west, just because of the spires. Everything's a little bit more pretty on the east too, I'm not gonna lie. I might start a new life over there, maybe on console release. Anyway dudes, I wanted to help you guys with the Discovery Zones cheat. Uh, I saw that somebody had actually, actually was uh, Dino, Dino Vart, Dino Vart. Maybe you guys saw that. He posted it in the, um, the Steam forums under like the Steam forum that has like all the cheats on it. Well, all that that guy put, I don't know. People are in the comments putting more cheats and I tried his out. He actually said it was give disco zones and I tried it and I saw somebody else saying, oh, that wouldn't work. So I tried tweaking that command to see if maybe it would work, if maybe he just left out a word, and he did. It's all. So it's uh, cheat space, give all this disco zone. So anyway, dudes, I figured I'd throw that out there for what it's worth. Hopefully it helps somebody. Keep an eye out for my other admin command videos, and I'll catch you guys on the flip-flop.